All right, what's up everyone? I'm here back with another video and in today's video, I have another FIFA Mobile video for you guys. In today's video, I'll just be showing you guys the new things that came out and just the new things that are happening in FIFA Mobile. So I don't know if I'll have this as a series, just episode two of FIFA Mobile. So if you guys do want to continue seeing FIFA Mobile content, leave a like on this video. The more likes will show me that you guys want to see these videos and make sure to subscribe to my channel for FIFA Mobile content and NBA Live Mobile and content and stuff like that. So first I'll be showing you guys the sets, but I have to do this Team Heroes thing because it expires in 14 seconds. So let me just do this really quickly. Let me just show you guys like what you can get and stuff like that. And then I'll show you guys a new set since the last time I have played played FIFA Mobile with you guys. So there's been a new update in FIFA Mobile, I think it's about a week ago. So paint the grid, that is the live event. It's super easy, you just try to go to the middle of the square. And that time I did it really bad. If you just go to the middle, you get all nine of the squares. So let me try to do it on the right side. I think I should get all nine. And yeah, so I get all nine like that. I'll do it on the left side and then I'll just go to the middle bottom. So it'll take me about four attempts if I get everything else perfect. So this live in is super, super easy. This is one of my favorites I've done so far. All right, so we completed pretty easy. It took me six attempts. I failed a couple times, like stupid of me, but all right, I completed it. So let's see what we get. Team hero chance pack. We'll probably just get a crappy player and we get, okay, a team, a crest for Man City. So I'll just keep that. I don't know what quite yet to what I want to put it in. So we get level nine. We reach level nine. We get a level up pack. Let's see what we can get in these level up packs. And we get, all right, a new player, a 70 overall striker. So that'll update the team. That is my best striker. So I'm super happy about that. But you guys can see the live events that are going on right now. You have the scouting thing. You have informed players, which I'll show you the new sets. And you have domination and training ground. I might complete, I have to complete the training plan to unlock this. So the new live events are pretty cool. Live events are definitely coming so much in FIFA Mobile than compared to NBA Live Mobile with like domination, informed players, team hero, all that. So if you go to plans, that's basically sets. If you go to events, you guys can see you still have domination. We have new informed players. So inform, 10 tokens will get you a random informed player, gold or better. And then you see the master set. You need 15 informed silver players, seven informed gold players, one elite informed player and 25 tokens. For the master card, a Manchester City center attacking mid, 86 overall. This card looks like a beast. You can't see the stats on cards in this game when you're on this screen. So, and I'm not quite sure if you can sell them or not. And actually, no, you cannot sell them. So I don't know what the stats are. If there's like a, you know, like nblive.gg for NBA Live Mobile or Mudhead for Madden Mobile. If there's a um, forums like that for FIFA Mobile, tell me in the comments below. Because I'll be trying to go on that and like try to see like the things in FIFA Mobile. Because like, because honestly right now in the point, FIFA Mobile is pretty confusing to me. And there's a new top transfers player that came out a couple weeks ago. And this is Pogba. So 91 overall, 91 overall center made. I'm not quite sure what the plus two means. So he returned to Manchester United from Juventus for 105 million euros. So that's absolutely insane. So you need all these elite players to actually complete the Pogba, which is absolutely insane. Like 89 overall Higuain, so many of these players, 10 elite Hummels. So this is absolutely insane to complete the Pogba. He probably goes for so much if he's even auctionable. And the scouting, so every week they have a new scouting thing. You get the collectible, you can get two options, either a league newcomer or out of position. So last week it was like the Rodriguez brothers or like the family or something like that. So right now we'll just complete one of the informed things. We'll get an informed pack on our first win. So it's one on one of the goalkeeper. You need to get four goals in 10 attempts. So let me see if I can do this in the first one, it's pretty easy. So I can dribble up definitely, so I'm just gonna try to dribble up, get a good, um, right there, let's go, all right. So this does seem pretty easy. Uh, I think this was a new striker I just got in the Team Heroes pack, which is pretty cool, but he misses off the crossbar, so that absolutely sucks. So right there, the goalie is coming in, we'll just try to go past him, and we do. So three out of four goals, we need one more goal, and we have five or six more attempts, I think. And he misses, so Manuel Neuer is the goalie in this, so he is pretty good, but right there we get it, so we complete it. We complete the inform thing, let's see what we can get, but inform pack, let's see what we can get from the inform pack, and it is... All right, a center back, Anderson, Steven Anderson from Scotland. So I'll update our team. He goes to the inform set. So you can only complete this once and you get a random player. And I would do domination for you guys, but you have to be level 12 and I am only level nine. So I can't do domination, but I'll just do these three scouting events for you guys. And that'll basically be the end of the video. So I'm not calling this like a road to Marco Royce because I mean, I'm just playing the live events. It's not like I'm actually like trying to grind for Marco Royce. So I'll just call it like a FIFA Mobile episode two, but this event is actually super hard. So actually never mind. I thought it would keep on moving so you have to predict the time, but this one's actually pretty easy. So 
I'll just go to that. Oh no, I thought it was gonna move, so that was stupid of me. I don't know, this is kind of difficult, but all right, that's pretty easy, so we complete scouting. Number one, I don't think you get any packs or anything from this. You just get that token you can get at the end that you can use in the random thing. So scouting number two, it costs two stamina. All these cost two stamina. So honestly, the scouting idea in FIFA Mobile, in my opinion, is very, very cool. I really enjoy the scouting idea a lot. They don't have anything like this in Madden Mobile or NBA Live Mobile, where every week can complete three things and get a token for a random player in like two random sets that they just created. But right here, I'm also doing super bad on this, so I need to get my timing down. So definitely lab events are so much harder in FIFA Mobile than NB Lab Mobile or Amanda Mobile. Like even the first couple weeks of NB Lab Mobile, these lab events are super easy. But in FIFA Mobile, just scoring a goal is much harder than scoring a touchdown or shooting a basket in Madden or NBA. So that's why definitely these lab events are much harder. But the last thing, scouting number three costs three stamina at this time, and we get the scouting pack for our first win. So it's target practice. We have to just hit the target. So it's like the opposite of the last one. So this one you just have to aim a little ahead of where the target's gonna go. So then when the target actually reaches there, the ball will reach there as well. So right there, the target should be there. So I think this one I got down pretty well because I've definitely done this event before. And let me, the target will go there. So boom, all right, last goal. Let's see what, if we can get a perfect on this, that would be absolutely awesome. This is the first time we've gone like a live event perfect, and I do, so four out of four, awesome, awesome, awesome. We get our scouting pack. Let's see if we can be absolutely awesome. I don't know which one I'll use. Uh, Luke newcomers are out of position. Maybe I'll do out of position, I don't know. All right, let's go for it. Out of position. Let's see what I can get. 250 coins, completing three different plans. What can I get in this out of position? And I get, all right, Rebillard. Rab Billard, I think. I don't know how to say his name. He's a French player, so he's another striker. So our team is a 62 overall. So I'll share that with my team at the end of this video. My best player on my attack is the new gold I got from the Team Hero set. My midfield is, I mean, decent. It's my best one. I have a game changer. I, I don't know, is that a call game changer? I'm not quite sure what it's called. A top transfer, my bad. And we have Rodriguez. And we have this one. Now, who's what type of card is this? Uh, a game changer. All right, so that is a game changer. And our defense is just a bunch of silvers. I had a couple goals, but I sold them. That's how I have 32,000 coins. So if you guys did enjoy the video, smash the thumbs up. Unless we can get 30 likes on the video. And tell me how you guys are liking FIFA Mobile so far. What's your favorite part about it? What's your least favorite part about it? And if you guys have not already, please subscribe to my channel for NBLI Mobile content, FIFA Mobile content, and Madden Mobile content. Until next time, guys, have a great day, stay awesome, and peace. You and I